Yeah, truly, you are. You are the champions. On behalf of my organization, Global Publishers, and on behalf of everybody, I feel so honored, so respected today to stand here before my next president, and my next prime ministers, my next doctors and engineers, my next scientists, my next leaders of political parties, and my next activists. So I want to thank, I want to thank the school administration, I want to thank the headmaster, I want to thank the teachers back at the corner, and I want to thank the organizers of this great event. I want to thank my team. Today here is, with me is Hamo Rapa and Hechimbizo. How many of you are happy to see Hamo Rapa today? That's very good. Uh, I am a citizen of this country. I'm a citizen of this country. I was born here. I grew up here. I went to school here. And I started the businesses here. So I love every person in this country, regardless of their status, regardless of their economic status, or their educational level. As long as they are Tanzanians, they are my Indugu. You understand that? So I come here as a parent who loves his children. I love my children so much. So when I see you, it's like I'm seeing my daughter. And I feel I have a responsibility to plant a seed of success in my fellow citizens. So I'm here today to sow a seed of success. I want to see you tomorrow achieving your dreams. I want to see you tomorrow become, becoming what you wanted to be. I'm here to inspire someone. I'm here to motivate someone. Because I believe when I know it is possible for every individual. Nobody was born to be poor. Nobody was born to be insignificant. All of us, all of us, regardless of our background, whether you come from a rich family, whether you come from a poor family, as long as you are alive and you have determinations and conviction within your heart, you can be whatever you want to be. Nobody was born to live this life and die, die at the end of the day without being remembered. All of us can do something and be remembered 1,000 years to come. Jesus Christ was a human being just like you and I. Mandela was a human being just like you and I. Mahatma Gandhi was a human being just like you and I. Madam Nyerere was a human being just like you and I. If those people, I can mention their names today, and they were just stu students like you many years ago, the same can happen to you. I'm sure from within my heart. You people who are listening to me this afternoon, some of you are going to be great people. Some of you will do things you can never imagine. Some of you will invent even HIV medicine. Some of you will innovate things that will make our country be known all over the world. Don't ever don't ever devalue yourself. Never walk this life seeing yourself like you have no value. All of us have value. All of us created by God, we have value. And we can live in this world and do something, contribute to the world, and help the world become a better place. 
so that 200 years later our names will be in the books someone here is the next president someone here is the next female president someone here someone listen to me this afternoon is the next prime minister someone here listening to me i know probably you don't feel like you are the one but i'm telling you you are the one who want to be the next president here can i see your hands up thank you brother thank you brother thank you and who wants to be the next prime minister can i see your hands up good thank you brother and who wants to be the next scientist can i see your hands up oh all right thank you and, and who wants to be who wants to be the next the next dara dara driver no one no one wants to be a dara dara driver right no one wants to be a dara dara or a boda boda driver right all of us wants to be big people all right all of us wants to be successful isn't it it is very very possible very possible it is very possible the only thing you have to do i will teach you today how to get to the top how many of you want to know that i will teach you today how to get to the what the top i will teach you how to get to the top because i know how to get to the top i was at the bottom now i am at the top so i know how to move from bottom to the top the reason why i'm here today i just want to share with you i just want to share with you the principles you can apply in your life and be successful how many of you are ready how many of you are ready how many of you are ready if you are ready say who ha if you already say who ha good good so uh kabla sijaendelea kabla sijaendelea ningetaka kumtambulisha kwenu rafiki yangu mpendwa Moses where is Moses umetoka kidogo lakini ningetaka kumtambulisha kabla Moses sajaja ni mtambulishe kwanza hechimbizo apate kuzungumza nanyi kidogo alafu atambulishe wimbo wake alafu atakuja atakuja hamorapa atazungumza kidogo aweleze historia yake alikotoka mpaka alipo wangapi wako tayari kumsikiza hamorapa good baadaye hamorapa akimeza kuzungumza nitampa Moses aimbe nyimbo kwa kutumia saxophone yake i want you to see how a talent and a gift can change someone's life how many of you here are talented yeah all of us have talents isn't it you other than talent is in you i want to show you how a talent can change someone's life i have moses here moses is a pianist moses ana piga nini ah what was that again saxophone all right moses is good at it i love moses wherever i go i want to go with who because i want you to listen to moses and see what moses can do and if someone here has a talent or a gift we are going to talk about gifts today how a gift can change your life even if you are failing math even if you are failing geography even if you are failing literature but still you can have a talent in you that can make your life better how many of you believe in talents i'm got to na mimi vipaji wangapi wanakubali kipaji kinaweza kubadilisha maisha yako asanteni sana